Te junto a Potamón y que ser en tu natan. I wish we were both to just fly away. I don't wanna care. It's being I'm good alone. I'll be okay. So welcome people to our video of today. So as you can see, we are in routine. So we're going to town. This is how we're going to spend the day. Don't worry about me. So anyways, so then this is how we're going to spend the day. I want you to spend the day with me. So first of all, we are taking our my nephew to the pediatrician for his injection. Then later on, we'll be going all around town as my plan of the day is. Then back to the house. Then I want you to watch down with me and see how I'm unwrapping my day so tag along and see how the day is going to be make sure you subscribe to my channel support me and keep it here So yes, Christmas is here and right here we are the paired and uh, we are waiting for the nurse who's supposed to give my nephew an injection. He got sick. It's the first time he's flying to Kenya at his, and he's young. So we are waiting here, uh, calmly waiting for my nephew to get his injection. And yes, the nurse is here. We waited uh, a little bit longer than we expected. So it is time for him to have his injection for the day. Then. After the injection, we'll be continuing with our day. So my niece here, she fears injection. You see where she's standing? At a distance, same to my son. So as you can see, the environment is so uh, conducive, like for the kids, the cartoon and all that. And we just spend the day with me. This is how we are, we are doing it for the day. Huh? This is how we are taking it down for the day. So calmly. An innocent baby, my nephew doesn't know that his injection is on the way. He's just there smiling. But the best thing is today, he did not cry. So we're done on to everything. And now it's time to continue with what we're supposed to do. So from here, next, you'll be seeing where we are going. So guys, this is the second place we are visiting for the day and uh, we are waiting for my son to have his hair cut. So both of them are seated. They're just more of twins right now. Like when one is doing something, the other one wants to do like, they're just like more of copying each other, but it's the best thing because they have a bond. Then while you are waiting, my mom had called. She asked where you are and here she is. Here goes my sweet mother. If you don't know her, that's her. If you've never seen her. Actually, I think this is the first video I'm showing my mother. That's my sweet mom. I, yes. So she always supports you. God bless you, mama. So my son got shaved. I was busy gossiping with my mom. So I didn't take a video of how he started being shaved until where it is. So when I came back, I found like he had too much hair here. So I had to tell the barber to cut it off to this level because they are home for a long holiday. Yes. So here he's so happy having his hair cut and he's really liking it. Though he gave me a warning, mom, it should not exit here. I don't want, but I couldn't because I've never even taken his hair like totally off his head. So let's continue with our day.
So we are done for the day. My son has his hair cut there, finishing wiping off the hair. And uh, I believe, and if there's one thing about me as a mom, I always admire my son so much because every time I look at him, I always see a reason to, move, to, to keep up or to keep going. His smile is everything. So when you want to take him a photo, you tell him to smile. He's always teeth out. Like he he removes out like the teeth, the teething of kids. You just know he doesn't know how to like smile. Like when you tell him, but there's always sometimes when he smiles off. So we are done for this session. He's ha he has had his beautiful or like handsome link haircut, and he's very happy about it. Though. I don't know if I'm the only person who always gets disturbed with a baby when you take them to the barber. Or the girls I know, they always disturb when they go to the salon. For my son, if I'm not around, he'll just be disturbed. So I cannot leave him in the to have his hair cut and I go. So we are done here. We on to our next phrase. So from here, I told you we are going to spend the day together. So we've come from the hospital, off the Kinyozi, the barber's shop, then now to the next session with is then boom the supermarket so i was unable to do a good vlog on the supermarket my son was so stubborn i don't know what was happening to him today. anyway we picked what we picked uh without taking a good video uh yes just being a mom i look like a mad woman in the supermarket when shouting at him like talking to him so done with everything at home i had to open up these are the stuff that we went to pick we said it's spending the day together these are the items we bought from the supermarket yes uh, we have some soap here as you can see and also on the video i won't explain everything uh, this is a new soap it's called dolphy dolphy i'm not marketing for it anyway but it's a good one it has a lot of form and at the aim of washing clothes when you have enough form so let's go on with the video <music> Yeah, we just came from town. People are eating what they want before we make food. We, all, we only take one meal a day. There are people who don't even take a meal. Uh, as in, like, there are people who take two meals. See, for us, it's one. Or you munch and you're good to go. Give my manners today. I did. I was so held up that I didn't take, like, good, good, good videos. But for these ones, we popped out after that and we had to get to the supermarkets to check on the trees that are being sold on the supermarkets because we are trying to get something for us for the christmas tree for no sorry for the christmas so we are trying to get a good tree and uh on jilani is where we were because that's where we did our sh as little shopping we didn't get something good like the trees that were left there were these ones small ones for 790 as you can see and they are very small that you don't even know how you're going to decorate them. So we had to pop in into Stagemart. This is Stagemart Supermarket for those people who are in Akuru. This is where we saw these trees. And I've seen they also have these plain trees. And they also have decorated tree of which they are different in prices. Yes. So the decorated tree are way much more expensive. Like this one is decorated. It's a good size actually and i realized it's worth the price you don't need to do much for yourself if you have a budget of 3700 you're good to go you have a tree with decor on it though it didn't have the lighting on because there was no socket in here yes i had to ask as an interested a client as an interested customer i had to ask <laughs> yes so this is what we saw here and we we, we had to settle on something because we believe there is still time because the trees are always there. There are those who have already put on their trees. There are some of us who have not yet put on. Don't worry, I'll show you a video. When, once I'm done with my tree, which tree I picked, then there's this other tree. My brother-in-law gave out a comment like it's really small. And this, the other one looks like that brush that you always use on washing a thermos. It was a fun one. Anyway, don't take it seriously. It's never serious. So when you're popping out, there's this tree. A big one and this one that is well decorated. For me, I feel like it's worth the price. Having the decor at that price as much as a supermarket. So beside all odds, went to the market. I didn't take a video 
too much like yeah too much like i always go to akulima and you know how congested it is so these are the items i brought there we have tomato carrots and ripe banana we have cabbages we have paprika uh, we have some bread you passed by naivas we have minced meat these are the things that some of them i'll be using to make dinner because i want you to be with me all through the day you will see what i'll be making for dinner <music> I've already boiled my milk the one that i came with now it's time to put water you've seen uh i'm be making spaghetti and um uh, meatballs as you've seen earlier i was trying to prepare things for the meatballs and right now it's time to boil the spaghetti and after boiling it i'll be running it with the uh, cold water so that um it doesn't what i say uh and uh, after running with hot water, the, uh, no, cold water, I'll be putting oil in a pot. Then I'll be putting my dried uh, spaghetti just to heat it up with some oil. Pia, so that it's a shikane. So I want you to see how I'm going to go about it. And for this far, I'm really grateful. Thank you for the support. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Keep on supporting me. And uh, yes, I'm so grateful. So... The oil, as you've seen, it has already hit. We've added our spaghetti. We are mixing it up. Then on this other side, I'll be preparing my meatballs. I was really hungry that I forgot that I should have started with the meatballs first. Then the spaghetti is later so that they don't get cold. But I've just done it. If you've not watched my video on kebabs, kindly watch it out so that you can be able to see how to make meatballs. I won't be able to show you on this video. But I'll be making meatballs frying them in an unstick then you'll be seeing how it will be turning out for the ingredients check out onto the kebab recipe i've already laid the uh, meatballs on the pan i'll be cooking it with oil turning them they turn brown putting them aside then we start frying so keep on watching make sure you subscribe to my channel i'm so humbled for the support keep on supporting me keep on supporting me So I've set my meatballs here, they are all ready. Then I'll be adding the boiled uh, sauce that you saw, boiling on the cooker, then putting it in the oven. Now here it's all done, it's all set, supper is ready, and this is how amazing my dish looks like. So I'm so humbled for this far. Thank you so much and enjoy the meal with me.